Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're into ethical hacking, cybersecurity, and all things tech, smash that like button, subscribe, and ding that notification bell so you never miss an upload. Today, we're diving headfirst into the fascinating world of OSINT, open source intelligence. We're talking about the tools and techniques that professionals use to gather information from publicly available sources. But remember folks, these tools are for ethical and educational purposes only. Stay curious, but always stay on the right side of the law. From uncovering hidden metadata to visualizing complex connections, we'll explore 10 of the most powerful OSINT tools available in Kali Linux. Buckle up because things are about to get very interesting. All right, kicking things off at number one, we've got Maltego. Now, if Sherlock Holmes were a piece of software, he'd probably be Maltego. This incredible tool allows you to visually map relationships between different pieces of data. Think of it like building a giant conspiracy board, but instead of red string and newspaper clippings, you've got digital connections between email addresses, websites, IP addresses, and even physical locations. Let's say you're investigating a phishing campaign. You've got a suspicious email address, but that's all you have to go on. With Maltego, you can drop that email into the interface and Maltego will start digging. It'll uncover connected websites, IP addresses linked to those websites, and potentially even social media profiles associated with those email addresses. Maltego is a favorite among cybersecurity professionals, investigators, and anyone who needs to connect the dots between seemingly unrelated pieces of information. And the best part, it presents all this data in a visually intuitive way, making it easy to understand even the most complex investigations. Now, Maltego does come in both free and paid versions. The free version offers a great starting point, but if you're serious about OSINT, the paid versions unlock even more powerful features and integrations. Trust me, whether you're tracking down a cyber criminal or just curious about the digital footprint you leave behind, Maltego is an absolute must-have in your OSINT toolkit. Moving on to number two, we've got the Harvester, and this tool is all about gathering those juicy email addresses, subdomains, host names, and more. Imagine a digital combine harvester, but instead of wheat, it's scooping up valuable information from the vast fields of the internet. Let's say you're a security researcher tasked with assessing the attack surface of a company. You could spend hours manually searching for email addresses and subdomains, or you could fire up the harvester and let it do the heavy lifting for you. Simply feed it a domain name, and the harvester will tirelessly scour search engines, public databases, and even social media platforms compiling a comprehensive list of potential targets. This means uncovering hidden infrastructure, identifying potential phishing targets, and gaining a much clearer picture of a company's online presence. The Harvester is incredibly fast, efficient, and best of all, it's completely free and open source. So if you're looking for a tool to automate your reconnaissance process and gather valuable OSINT, look no further than the Harvester. It's the perfect tool for ethical hackers, penetration testers, and anyone who wants to level up their reconnaissance game. At number three, we have Shodan, and this one's a real game changer. Forget Google. Shodan is like the internet search engine with X-ray vision. Instead of indexing websites and web pages, Shodan indexes devices, servers, webcams, industrial control systems, you name it. If it's connected to the internet, Shodan probably knows about it. Now you might be thinking, why would I want to search for devices? Well, for security researchers and ethical hackers, Shodan is an absolute goldmine. It allows you to discover exposed and potentially vulnerable systems that would otherwise be hidden from view. Let's say you're worried about a particular type of vulnerability, like a specific version of a web server software. You can use Shodan to search for all devices running that specific version, instantly identifying potential targets for further investigation. You can even see the geographic location of these devices, giving you a visual map of potential vulnerabilities around the world. Shodan is an incredibly powerful tool, and it's important to remember that with great power comes great responsibility. Always use Shodan ethically and legally, and never attempt to access systems that you don't have permission to access. Coming in at number four, we have Recon Eng. And this one is for all you tinkerers and customization enthusiasts out there. Recon Ang is a modular framework for web reconnaissance, meaning it's like a set of building blocks that you can assemble and customize to create your own unique OSINT workflows. Think of it like this. 
Imagine you have a toolbox full of specialized tools, each designed for a specific reconnaissance task. You've got tools for harvesting email addresses, tools for discovering subdomains, tools for profiling social media accounts, and so much more. Recon Eng lets you take these individual tools, called modules, and chain them together to create automated workflows that perfectly suit your needs. Need to investigate a company's online presence? Chain together modules that gather employee information, map out their social media networks, and identify potential security vulnerabilities. The real beauty of Recon Ang lies in its flexibility and extensibility. Don't see a module for what you need? No problem. You can create your own custom modules using Python and contribute them back to the community. So if you're ready to take your OSINT game to the next level and build your own custom reconnaissance arsenal, Recon Ang is the tool for you. At number five, we have Spiderfoot, and let's be honest, nobody likes manual data collection. It's time consuming, it's tedious, and frankly, it's just plain boring. Well, say goodbye to manual labor and hello to automation with Spiderfoot, your new favorite OSINT assistant. Spiderfoot takes a target, whether it's a domain name, an email address, an IP address, or even a username, and automatically scours over 100 different data sources to build a comprehensive profile. We're talking search engines, social media platforms, ByteOIS records, DNS records, and so much more. But Spiderfoot doesn't just dump a mountain of data in your lap and call it a day. It organizes all this information into beautiful interactive graphs highlighting connections and relationships that would be nearly impossible to spot manually. Imagine easily seeing the connections between a company's employees, their social media accounts, the websites they visit, and even the physical locations they've been tagged in. Spiderfoot makes it all possible, and it does it with the click of a button. Whether you're a seasoned investigator or just starting out with OSINT, Spiderfoot will save you time, effort, and maybe even a few headaches along the way. Coming in at number six, we have Senses, and this one's for all you data enthusiasts out there. Senses is a powerful search engine that allows you to explore the internet's infrastructure like never before. We're talking about gaining deep insights into software configurations, certificate details, and potential security vulnerabilities. Imagine being able to see which web servers a company is using, what versions of those servers are running, and whether or not they're vulnerable to known exploits. Or how about identifying all the devices on a network that are using a specific type of encryption protocol, allowing you to assess the overall security posture? Census makes it all possible by constantly scanning the internet and collecting data on billions of devices and their configurations. And the best part? Census provides this data in an easily searchable and filterable format, making it incredibly powerful for security researchers, penetration testers, and anyone involved in vulnerability management. So if you're looking for a tool to help you understand the internet's infrastructure, identify potential security risks, and stay one step ahead of the bad guys, Census is an invaluable resource. At number seven, we have FOCA, and this tool is all about uncovering the hidden secrets lurking within your documents. You see, documents often contain metadata, information about the file that's not immediately visible, but can reveal a surprising amount of information. FOCA is a metadata analysis tool that specializes in extracting metadata from documents like PDFs, Microsoft Word files, and image files. We're talking about uncovering author names, email addresses, software versions, creation dates, modification times, and even GPS coordinates embedded within those files. Imagine you're investigating a data breach and you come across a leaked document. FOCA can help you determine the document's origin, who created it, when it was last modified, and potentially even where it was created. This information can be crucial in piecing together the timeline of an attack, identifying the source of a leak, or even tracking down the individuals responsible. FOCA is an incredibly valuable tool for investigators, journalists, and anyone who deals with sensitive information. It's a reminder that even seemingly innocuous documents can contain a wealth of hidden information, and FOCA is the key to unlocking those secrets. Coming in at number eight, we have Metagoofil, and this tool is like a giant magnet for documents. Metagoofil is designed to scan entire websites and automatically download specific types of files like PDFs, Word documents, Excel spreadsheets, and more. But Metagoofil doesn't just download these files, it also extracts valuable metadata from them, giving you insights into a company's internal workings. 
Imagine being able to download every single publicly accessible PDF from a company's website. You could potentially uncover internal memos, financial reports, presentations, and all sorts of other sensitive information. MetaGoofle makes it incredibly easy to gather this data, and it can be a goldmine for competitive intelligence, security assessments, and even investigative journalism. Of course, it's crucial to use MetaGoofle ethically and legally. Never download or access files that you don't have permission to access, and always respect the privacy of others. At number 9, we have the OSINT framework, and this one's not a tool in the traditional sense, but rather an invaluable resource for anyone involved in OSINT. The OSINT framework is a website that curates and categorizes a massive collection of tools, websites, and resources related to open source intelligence. Imagine a giant library, but instead of books, it's filled with everything you need to conduct OSINT investigations. Whether you're looking for tools to gather information on social media, investigate financial transactions, track down individuals, or analyze malware, the OSINT framework has got you covered. The best part? The OSINT framework is completely free to use and constantly updated with the latest and greatest OSINT resources. It's an essential bookmark for beginners and seasoned professionals alike, providing a centralized hub for all things OSINT. So if you're ever feeling lost or overwhelmed in the world of OSINT, just remember the OSINT framework, your one-stop shop for all your OSINT needs. And finally, at number 10, we have Google Dorking a technique that's as old as Google itself, but still incredibly effective. Google dorking or Google hacking is all about using advanced search operators to refine your Google searches and uncover hidden information that wouldn't normally show up in standard search results. You see, Google is an incredibly powerful search engine, but most people only scratch the surface of its capabilities. With Google dorks, you can use special keywords and operators to tell Google exactly what you're looking for, bypassing the clutter and zeroing in on specific file types, sensitive directories, exposed configurations, and so much more. For example, let's say you're looking for publicly accessible webcams. A simple Google dork like innerl-view slash index.html can reveal a list of vulnerable webcams around the world. Or maybe you're trying to find sensitive documents containing financial information. A dork-like file type PDF in-text financial report can help you uncover those hidden gems. The power of Google dorking lies in its simplicity and versatility. With a little bit of creativity and the right search operators, you can unlock a treasure trove of information using the world's most popular search engine. So there you have it, folks. The top 10 OSINT tools in Kali Linux for 2024. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Use these tools ethically and legally. If you're serious about ethical hacking and cybersecurity, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications for more tutorials, tool reviews, and exciting challenges. Stay ethical, stay secure, and keep those firewalls strong.